Here's your new desk, kid. You're on traffic. The hot sheet is posted here next to the map. What's his problem? That's Biggs. He's an institution. So this is what all the fuss is about. Why couldn't they build a freeway that goes past my place? They haven't even approved the money yet, kid. The bond issue won't be till December. It'll be years before any of this will happen. Here's your new partner, Stefan Burkowski. I've heard all about you, Phelps. You go easy on me and let me earn the odd citation, and maybe we'll get along fine. I'm here to learn, detective. <laughs> oh, he's an intense one, isn't he, Mel? Is he Brad Pitt? The newly minted detective here, Cole Phelps. Hi, Phelps. I'll be keeping an eye on you. I can spend a little time basking in reflected glory. Make a change from busting hookers and dope fiends. Mm -hmm. Who was that, Commander? Roy Earl, chief detective and advice. Are they all dressed like movie stars? Well, Roy is a movie star. And the whole of the seedy side of L.A. is his audience. Mm -hmm. What is that supposed to mean? Stick with me, kid. You'll find out. Yeah, Leonardo DiCaprio. Yeah. And now some housekeeping. Warm Central Division welcome for Detective Cole Phelps. Some of you guys may know <laughs> Phelps. He's the cop who broke the jewelry store murder. Stand up and take a bow, Phelps. If it's all right with That's you, sir. That's an order, Phelps. <laughs> Quiet, everybody. <laughs> Phelps is one of only two serving LAPD officers who received the Silver Star during the war. Really gave it to those lousy Japanese, eh, Phelps? Uh, I did my best, Captain. Why you war heroes always so modest? I've partnered Phelps with everybody's favorite pole, Stefan Bukowski. <laughs> Hope you like work, kid. Bukowski sure as hell doesn't. Well, that's why we have partners, right? <laughs> okay, okay, can it, guys. <laughs> Stick with Bukowski. He's a good cop. He knows traffic inside now. I'm going to start you out with one case. Do okay? I'll give you a couple more. You screw mm -hmm. up. You'll be rousing vagrants and running license plates. Now get uh. down to the P.E. Freight Depot, 6th and Alameda. A patrolman called in a suspicious vehicle. Signs of foul play. See what you can find out. Come on, Phelps. The canary says he'll sing. So, hallo und schön, dass ihr wieder eingeschaltet habt zum fünften Fall von L.A. Noir. Oh, ich muss mal einen Schluck trinken, der Moment. Oh, ja. Hm. You're wasting time. Get out of here. Yeah, yeah, I get it out of here. Okay, and after we the other fellas so well gelöst haben. Of course, a girl can ask a fella out. They really pushed you through quick, didn't they? Six years on patrol before I got this desk. You were here in five minutes. What hmm. do you want me to say? I didn't ask for any favors. He's only a writer, so he can't really help me. <laughs> That's that guy from the paper. Says I'll say. It's not that big case. I guarantee he walks. <laughs> you know this place? Yeah, sorry. Sure. Near the old gas works and signal depot in the warehouse district. I'll direct. No, this is fake. Das ist schon der Kippen, die Werbung an. Wie bei Fallout 3 haben sie es direkt, direkt aus der Zeit genommen. Cool, gell? Okay. Keep going on this road. All units of 459 just occurred at 6th and Saris. Any unit to handle, code 2, identify. Oh. So, tell me a little about yourself, Phelps. Are we friends now, Rakowski? We have to work together, don't be so touchy. I grew up in San Francisco. My father was in shipping. I went to college at Stanford. Did two years ROTC before Marine OCS at Camp Elliott. Shipped out in early 45 as a first lieutenant and fought in the Okinawa campaign. I was wounded, shipped back home. Did a year on the beat. Now I'm here. So you won the Silver Star. I don't want to talk about it. Now let me get this straight. You single-handedly killed 40 Japs on this hill in Okinawa. No. You were up there all night, draped in the flag, knife between your teeth, gun at the ready. You finished? The Emperor Hirohito himself leading the charge against you. I did my part, Bukowski. What did you do? I kept the streets of L.A. safe for the people. Yeah. Now I get it. Unfit for service. 
Fuck you, Phelps. I earned a bravery citation during the Zuda riots. Sounds like you had it rough. I did my job. No one is saying you didn't. All units of 459 just occurred at 6th and Saras. Any unit to handle, code 2, identify. 11K, go ahead, KGPO. 11K, a 459 suspect just left. Up on the roof, officer. He has a mask on his face. I caught sight when he shoved past me, but be careful. Mm -hmm. I saw him waving a gun. Oh. Give it up now. Make it easy on yourself. Get the hell away from me. Na, das bringt diesmal leider nichts. mal gespannt. Na, uh, uh. Oh. Now, are we gonna make a bargain or what? Scheiße. How long do you think you can hold out? Also bei Police Quest 2. Ja. <lacht> Hätte muss die Waffe kalibrieren müssen. Am Schießstand unten. Sonst wäre das in die Hose gegangen. Auch nicht. War das jetzt die einzige Möglichkeit, um den zu überwältigen? Ah. Die Karre ist ziemlich dreckig geworden dabei, oder? Bin noch gar keine Pfütze gefahren. Take the next train. That you, Bukowski? Go on through. Parking lot straight ahead. Mm -hmm. I need to get back to work, officer. The detectives are here now. You repeat to them what you told me. I did the right thing by calling this in. I'm just a working stick. Just give him your story and you'll be all right. This is your first case, Phelps. It's okay to admit it if you're stumped. If you don't know what to do next, just come talk to me and we'll see what we can figure out. Thanks, Stefan. You're okay. I'm Officer Hart. Phelps, traffic. What have you got? Abandoned car, probably stolen. The solid citizen is Nate Wilkie. He called it in. What gives with the corner? There's blood all over the interior. Someone's copped the full Broderick, but no stiff as yet. We have an owner for the car? The car is registered to an Adrian Black, just north of Bunker Hill. All right, we'll take a look around. I'll keep Mr. Wilkie talking, but don't make him wait too long. He's the restless type. Okay. Nice day for it. How long are you gonna keep me here, sir? How's the world looking? I better get back to work, sir. Ah, always the same two of you, fine. How about you? Doc, Detective 
Phelps. What have we got? A lot of blood for a blunt force injury. The victim must be in a very bad way. Any sign of the guy? Not unless he's in the trunk of the car. Okay. The victim looks to have lost a lot of blood. Und ist im Kofferraum? It doesn't appear to be connected. Na, ist so sauber und kein Blut dran, gell? Na, ist da kommen. Lebendiges Schwein, oder was? Cool. Mr. F. Morgan had an independent Schwein Mr. F. Morgan picked up a live pig yesterday? Okay. Gibt's denn von der Seite aus noch was zu sehen? Na, no, gibt's nichts mehr, okay. Oh, was ist das hier? Beweisstück B. The brand name might give us something to go on. Insta Heat. Sonst noch was? Nee. Okay. Gibt's noch ein Beweisstück? C. Und wo ist Beweisstück A? A. Beweisstück A. Schön, dass die Spurensicherung schon da war. Stenzel, Stenzel Glasses. Home repaired by the look of it. Ja. Im Harry Potter Style mit Klebeband. Selbst repariert, okay. Was ist das hier? Happier times, I guess. Okay. Adrian Black. Thirty-two years old, married. Sounds like an average guy. What was he doing out here? Okay. Let's make this mal kurz mal durchgehen, was es hier gibt. Where's Nate Wilk? Ah, das ist der Schwarze. Okay. Gibt es den Adrian Black? Vermisster Eigentümer, genau dem gehört das Auto. Der Herr Morgan hat, es, hat die Unterschrift auf der Quittung gemacht vom Schlachthaus. Und die Mrs. Black ist die Frau von Adrian Black. Okay. Noch irgendwelche Hinweise? Ja, 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 ja. Okay, ich ja, alles klar. Dann glaube ich, bin ich bereit für die Befragung. Ja, Beweisstück A, B, C. Sonst sehe ich kein gelbes Kärtchen mehr. Sir, I'm Detective Phelps. Name's Nate Wilkie. You found the vehicle? Sure. Saw it just sitting there. Strange place to be parking your car. Figured I'd better take a look. And then I saw all the blood. So I called the police. Mind if I ask what you were doing out here? Well, I work for the railway. 
I was on my way out to the switch and reckoned I'd take a shortcut. Aha. Ja, das ist die Wahrheit. Gucken wir an. Did you see anybody else in the yard? Maybe somebody hanging around the car? Nope. I hadn't seen a soul all day till you boys turned up. Okay. Do you know Adrian Black, Mr. Wilkie? No, sir. That ain't a name I'm familiar with. Yo. You ever seen the car before? Funny enough, I did. A couple of nights ago, it was over there in the parking lot. I know most of the cars that park here regular, so it kind of stood out. Okay. We found a steel pipe with blood on it near the car. Do you know anything about it, Mr. Wilkie? No, sir. I went straight for the law when I saw the car was full of blood. Das ist auch, auch Wahrheit, oder? Der guckt so. When you saw Glaubt the blood, was it wet, bright red, or uh, darker like it is now? Darker, I'd say. Looked dry already. Okay. The wallet by the car. Was there anything in it when you arrived? You accusing me of something, mister? Oh, der guckt so. Oh. Aha, <laughs> uh -huh. Lüge. Nee, das ist nur Zweifel. Do you want the patrolman to hold you down while we turn out your pockets, Mr. Wilkie? Maybe I checked inside that wallet. <laughs> Not that I was gonna steal anything. Uh. Maybe I took a look. But there weren't no money in there. Not even change. Thank you for your help, Mr. Wilkie. We'll yeah. contact your employer if we need anything more from you. Oh, we go. If you have to, I guess. I can't really spend no more time over this. Somebody's got to inform the wife, Phelps. If you're done here, we'll head over there now. The mama does. Ah. Huh. You can drive. And where exactly are we going? The bunker hill. Das ist schon geil, das Spiel irgendwie. Das hat es mir jetzt voll angetan. Da wird Skyrim mal warten müssen, aber ich habe auch gerade genug von Skyrim. Echt, ich kann es gerade nicht mehr sehen, aber. Ist okay, ich habe jetzt, glaube ich, 20 Stunden. Habe ich da jetzt schon rumgezogen? Let's go introduce ourselves. You talk to her, Phelps. I'm no good at this shoulder to cry on stuff. Uh oh. Just a minute. Uh oh. LAPD, Mrs. Black. May we come in? We have some bad news and we'd rather discuss this in private. I'm Margaret Black. We can discuss this in the living room. Please come in. Your husband drives a blue Lincoln, Mrs. Black? That's correct. The car has been found abandoned and I'm afraid there are signs of foul play. I knew something was wrong when he didn't come home. We believe your husband may be injured. We found a pipe on the scene with blood on it. Oh, no! My poor Adrian! Does the name Instaheat mean anything to you, ma'am? Yes, it does. We've just had a new water heater installed. Whereabouts, mm -hmm. Mrs. Black? Just outside the kitchen window, at the side of the house. I'd like you to try and stay calm and remember everything that you can about last night. My partner and I are going to take a look around. When you're ready, we're going to have some more questions for you. Is that okay? Of course, officer. Anything to help secure my husband's safety. Okay. Let's check the place out. Come on. Und check wir mal den place out. Oh. <laughs> I doubt it. Yeah, doubt it. Yeah, yeah, it's right.
Wo fangen wir an? Fangen wir mal hier an. Tisch, Handschuhe, Zigaretten. Was ist das hier? Cabinas. So, who brought this home? Have a good look around. There's gotta be something in here to go on. Kavanaugh's Bar. Oi. Maybe Adrian was a patron. R and I should have an address. Cool, okay. Find ein Telefon nach der Adresse zu fragen. Was steht in der Zeitung? down, make yourself comfortable. So, your friend of Courtney's. Hmm. Yes, doctor. He seems very concerned about you. I have these visions, these blinding visions. I can't get them out of my head. My skull, it, it feels like it's in a vice. I want to give you something to calm your nerves. Oh, was macht denn der da? I want to take you on a journey. A journey back. I want you to remember the good things about your past. Occasions that made you laugh. Times that made you smile. Mhm. Mm okay. Hatte das jetzt was mit dem Fall zu tun? Falscher Knopf. Okay, die Küche. Nochmal, nochmal diese Streichhölzer. Gibt es hier noch irgendwas? Zettel am Kühlschrank? Nein. Hier auf dem Tisch. Insta Heat. Mhm. Cool, okay. Na, hab ich doch jetzt, hallo. Was sind die denn hier jetzt? Aha, Instaheat Rechnung. Okay. This was only recently installed, not two days ago. Maybe it's time we took a look around outside. Ich bin aber noch gar nicht nach draußen. Okay, von LA nach Seattle am 3. Dezember. Es war gestern, gell? Ist der vierte. A used ticket to Seattle and a suitcase gone missing. Someone couldn't wait to get out of this house. Also ich sag gleich mal was, der hat ein lebendes Schwein irgendwie da gekauft, im Auto wahrscheinlich. Und hat ein Zugticket, wo er jetzt irgendwo hinfährt, ja. Der wird bestimmt, das vermute ich jetzt einfach ganz stark, ja. Sein Tod vortäuschen. <lacht> Man ist gar nicht tot, ist gar niemand gestorben. Vermute ich jetzt. This must be Adrian's. Genau, und er hat eine Stenzelbrille. Ah, ja, ja, ja. Stenzel. 
so the glasses are a match. Geht doch. Das heißt, der Tote ist Adrian. Der Hübsche. Nicole. Oh. Nicole X. To my Adrian. This thing gets more and more interesting. Ah, die Nicole ist auf jeden Fall schon mal nicht die Ehefrau. Ich könnte mir vorstellen, die Nicole, die wohnt in Seattle. Okay. Noch was hier drin? Nö, nee, oder? Vielleicht in dem Wäschekorb da? Nö, nee, im Boden? Nö. Nee. Hier? Nö. Nee. Den Koffer? Ah ja, das haben wir schon gehabt. Okay, alles klar, dann gibt es hier nichts mehr. Ist das hier Schlafzimmer? Ah, das ist so die Frau. Separate bedrooms, separate pictures. Oh. What gives here? Mhm. Mm Stimmt, getrennte Schlafzimmer, wenn die doch verheiratet sind. Und sie ist die. Ich muss noch meine Sinne schärfen. Wenn der das jetzt nicht gesagt hätte, hätte ich auch geglaubt, das ist ja ein Zimmer mit zwei Betten. Da hier ein Bett, ja? Na klar, das ist ein Doppelbett, aber. Da bin ich auch der einzige Depp, der das denkt. Typisch Mann halt. Gibt es hier noch mehr zu entdecken? Das ist ja höchst interessant. Ah ja, Telefon. Operator, give me dispatch. Putting you through now. Phelps badge 1247. How could I help, Detective? I need an address on a Kavanaugh's bar. Certainly, Detective. One moment. Kavanaugh's bar, corner of Aliso and Hewitt, south side of Union Station. Thanks for your help. Okay. Gehen wir mal zu der Bar dann. Okay, jetzt bin ich hier. Hier war ich schon gewesen. Jetzt gehen wir mal raus. Ah, ne, 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 ne. Ups. Na, wenn das hier nicht das gute Stück schon ist. Now you're just leaving the thing half finished. Hä? Ach, muss ich das jetzt zusammensetzen, oder was? Na, ne, ne, hier, na, ja. Nein. That can't be right. Hier. Das sieht ja ein Blinder mit Krückstock. Nein, hier, ja. Und ein Teil fehlt. So the pipe missing from Mr. Black's heater is the same one that killed him. Huh. Seems like the assailant is a little closer to home. Okay. Nein, Moment, ich muss kurz auf die Toilette. <lacht> Bin wieder da. Okay. Oh, ein Korb. Na, ja, das war's schon. Oh, gut. Das wird ja interessant, aber. Gibt's noch was? Ich kann gar nicht glauben. Hier gibt's noch eine Tür. Was ist für eine Tür hier? Ah, fast einen Raum vergessen. Den Waschraum. Aber hier gibt's nichts. Okay. Okay, Miss Black, are you ready? I'm all right now, detectives. We found a receipt in the trunk of your husband's car for a live pig. 
This receipt was made out to an F. Morgan. A pig? Adrian runs a tool business. That would be Frank Morgan. God knows what he's up to. No. Yeah. What makes you say that about Morgan, ma'am? He's the foreman at my husband's plant. A very shady character. I told Adrian he needs to keep his distance from the staff. They're always out drinking together. Mhm. Mm Wo trinken sie zusammen? Your husband frequents Kavanaugh's bar. How did you know that? Adrian practically lives there after work. Ja, bestimmt. So Adrian spends a lot of time there. Up until recently, he's been away in Seattle a lot on business. Oh. Das ist ja interessant. Come on, Did your husband tell you where he was going last night? All he said was he was going to meet Frank for a drink. Ja, glaube ich auch. Hey, ich bin zu leicht, ich kriege alles falsch. Well, he came home early from work. He never comes home early. <laughs> And he went out early too. He normally never leaves for the bar till about seven. Mm -hmm, okay. Brillenetui. Was your husband wearing his glasses when he left here yesterday? Yes, he just bought a new pair. <laughs> yeah, stimmt auch. Go on. I kept telling him to throw those old ones away. He tried to repair them with tape. It yeah. Terrible. Yes. Tell us about the photo of Adrian in the bedroom. What is there to tell? It's from his most recent business trip to Seattle. Mm -mm, die guckt schon so. Ja, aber da hat sie recht, ist ja auch. Aber da fehlt das, oder? You and your husband are in separate bedrooms. What gives? Did you want him out of the way, Margaret? No, I did not. My husband and I may have drifted apart, but it, it wasn't my choice. Okay. No, what? I think you should come clean with us, Mrs. Black. Your husband is missing, and after our search, I'm willing to call the circumstances suspicious. Can you account for your movements last night? You're not accusing me, are you? Oh, what an awful thing to say. I was here all night, of course, waiting for Adrian to come home. Ja. Doch, oder? Was meint ihr? Doch. Wahrheit. Is there anyone who can vouch for that? Well, no. I I was here alone. I cooked Adrian's dinner and waited, but he never came home. We'll keep you informed, Mrs. Black. Please do, detective. Werden wir auch. Okay, dann geht's jetzt nach was war Kevin aus Bar. He's good looking for a policeman. Danke schön. Ja. You're behind the wheel. Wow. That sure looks like hm? a beauty. You drive. I need to go over the case notes. Oh, die Fahrerei ist nicht so. Jesus, I'm glad to be out of there. Mr. and Mrs. Black don't seem to have the happiest home life. He's too scared to divorce her, and she's too much of a shrinking violet to throw him out. If this hadn't happened, they could have stayed miserable together forever. You think she could have killed him? She sure as hell doesn't seem the type. But stranger things have happened. Yes, for lovely, lustrous hair. Also, ganz ehrlich, ich glaube immer noch meine Theorie. Und wir beschweinen ja, warum soll jemand ein Schwein kaufen? Wir würden leben, was? Ich habe jetzt den Blutet. Hey, I know you. No, you don't. <lacht> Tell the cook these were some good grits. You looking for someone? Would you recommend the special, miss? You 
want a tip? We'll fill my coffee faster next time, honey. I can't decide between you the know tuna Frank fish Morgan and the chicken. Sure. Frank's a regular. He's a loner in the back. Mm-hmm. Boy, that steak has seen better than Frank days. Morgan? Who's asking? Cole Phelps, LAPD. I understand you're a friend of Adrian Black. Yeah, I know him. Are you aware that he's missing? No, I hadn't heard that. Tough break. Ah, klingt der verlogen, ey. Das gibt's ja gar nicht. We found Black's car abandoned in a freight depot, covered in blood. You know anything about that, Morgan? Hell no. I, I, I'm sorry to hear that. I like Adrian. He, he's a good oh, boss. Please, don't tell me you actually believe this jerk off, Phelps. Hmm, ich mach Lüge. You're lying, Morgan. You were there. And you're talking out your ass, Detective. How about you prove I was out at that rail yard? Na, hier. Das ist Schweinequittung, huh? Das ist das Einzige, was wir haben. You were there, Morgan. We found a receipt in the trunk of the car. It has your name Na, on it. Jawohl. We can call the slaughter yard and nail you on it. All right, already. <laughs> that fool Adrian's fallen for some dame in Seattle. He he wanted me to make it look like he'd been attacked. Oh, I wanted him also. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Where exactly is Black holed up? No idea. I think he took off for Seattle. Ne, 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 ne. I'm tired of your shtick, Morgan. Spill it! Or we take you out in the alley and we knock it out of you. He's holed up at my place. He's waiting for some money to come through before he blows town. <laughs> an address? It's an apartment house at the corner of Temple and Figueroa. Apartment number two. Und jetzt nimmt ihm noch sein Handy ab? <laughs> I think that's all. Thanks for your help, Morgan. We appreciate it. Hey, I'm just glad I could help. I love cops. Cuff him, <laughs> let him go. It's up to you, Phelps. There's no way I'm writing this idiot up. He wants a five-star goddamn wedding. You got Morgan's address? <laughs> Let's get over to his apartment. Uh, uh. Leute, es macht mir einen Heidenspaß ohne Witz und ich fahre jetzt auch selber. Weil es mir sogar so viel Spaß macht. Was für ein geiles Spiel ohne Witz, ey. Und wen werden wir da jetzt finden? Ihn, wie ich es gesagt habe. Hm? Wie ich es gesagt habe. Der hat sich in die Pussy verliebt, da hat er das Schwein geholt. Zusammen noch mit seinem anderen Typ und dann... Was ist das hier? Ah. Was ist das hier? Oh. Ja, markier das mal. Da fahren wir jetzt nämlich hin. I met some pretty good liars in my town. People who sound convincing because they actually believe their own bullshit. <laughs> the type is clever, hard to catch out. Frank Morgan is not one of those people. No, he is not. KGBL calling car 11K. 11 King, come in. 11 K, go ahead. Message from Technical Services. Blood found in the abandoned Lincoln at the PE Freight Depot is not human. Repeat, uh -huh. not human. Compositional yeah. analysis reveals swine as the most likely match. Roger, KGPL. Kind of real this guy in, folks. Weiß, wie ich es gesagt habe, ha? Oh, so schön. Wenn man ein bisschen mitraten kann.
jetzt ist so dieses Verbrechen ganz auf der anderen Seite von L.A. Responding, go ahead. You can drop that money one more time and you're a goner. Sorry, mister. It's just my hands are shaking. Shut up! Get the money in the bag. Yes. Yes, sir. Hurry the hell up, will you? Come on. It's goddamn cops! Careful! He's got a gun! Stop here! You're making a break for it on foot. So sind sie auch überwältigt. Ich wollte sie jetzt nicht gleich umbringen, aber ja, was soll ich sagen? Car 11K to KGPL. Bristol Hotel 211 ist Code 4. Ich muss mich advise Code 4 at the Bristol Hotel on 8th Street. Code 4. Holen wir ihn jetzt mal ab, den feinen Herrn Black. Straight through the next intersection. Next right. Turn left up ahead. Hier left. Taking the next left. Okay. Well, let's check the place out. Come on. Apartment 2. Apartment 2. Mal wieder. Wie vorher. Help you gentlemen? Ach, LAPD Detective Mr. Black. You're under arrest. Mhm. Look. 
I'm really sorry about this. I never tried to hurt anyone. I just needed to get away from L.A. <laughs> I won't put up a struggle. Just uh. let me get my things. Oh, it's often that big. I knew it! Kill Phelps, him go him. after him. I'll try and head him off in the car. Remember, the gun is the last resort. There's no point running, Adrian. Er will die alle schnell rennen können. Mr. Black, get back here right now. Ah, scheiße. Right there, er rutscht halt nicht. Jetzt rutscht er. It's over, Adrian. Why not just come clean with her, Black? Why the melodrama? I thought it would be easier. No, it just got a whole lot harder. Adrian Black, you're under arrest for conspiracy and fraud. We'll see what the DA has to say about wasting police resources on a wild goose chase like this. You're gonna lose your wife? Lose your job and probably end up in the big house. I hope she was worth it, Adrian. That turned out to be quite some mm. case, huh? Adrian, mm. what an idiot. You got an arrest and a clearance in your first case and in fine style, too. Well done, detective. Efficient investigation technique, good public presence. You keep that up and you <laughs> learn from Bukowski here, and you could go a long way in this department. Das war doch das perfekte. Dankeschön. Danke. Ja, ich, ich weiß. Okay, in der Tiefgarage diese Sache mit diesem Typ, den ich über den Haufen gefahren habe. Was soll man sagen? Cool. Fünf Sterne. Ja. Mit den richtigen Beweisen hätte sie alles über ihren Ehemann ausgeplaudert. Okay, und was, haben, was hat mir gef gefehlt von Beweis? Steht das hier dran? Fragen habe ich auch nicht alle richtig. Hm. Okay, super, die Folge ist zu Ende. Schaltet wieder ein beim nächsten Mal. Ich freue mich schon drauf. Ähm, dann kommt der Fall 6. Der Wagen des Konsuls. Ciao.